Hello, everyone, and welcome again to our high school football preview show. Another triple header of action here on the sister stations. We're excited to bring those to you. Let's take a look at our games. First of all, on the AM, Sydney and Lexington. Sydney coming off a loss last week to a McCook team that's kind of been surprisingly good. So, tough matchup maybe for Lexington this week. And it is a tough matchup. Lexington also dealing with some key injuries as well. McEwen will be out for this game and really for the rest of the season for this Lexington Minuteman team. So, they're going to really have to step things up. I look for Kyle Doty to get the ball just a couple more times uh, now that with McEwen out. But uh, it'll be an interesting game. And uh, I look for Sydney to try to bounce back into the win column uh, here in uh, Lexington. They certainly will have the Minutemen, Minutemen's attention, that's for sure. Should be a good game. Also, we have Superior at Southern Valley, a game that you're calling down there uh, just south of Oxford, almost to Kansas, and a uh, uh, couple one and three teams. What do you expect to see in this game? Well, it's a, kind of a rebuilding time for both of these groups, um, both teams. Uh, Second-year head coaches Bob Fredrickson for Southern Valley and uh, Brandon Siegel for Superior, both one and three. And uh, for Southern Valley, though, they're coming off a six and four season and went to the playoffs last year. Though superior two and seven last year, they're still trying to find the winning formula. And talking to head coach Siegel of Superior, he said that they're still trying to find that right spot for that for those certain players. Uh, only three returning uh, start starters as far as seniors go, and so a lot of mix and matching. Uh, but they have played better as of late. Only lost by one touchdown to what River, and only lost a point uh, last week. Southern Valley, same thing. They started out sluggish, but they've played a lot better. Uh, Chance Best for Southern Valley is thrown for 503 total yards, so he can uh, definitely tear it up through the air, uh, but also on the ground as well. So it'll be a good head-to-head -head matchup uh, for both of these teams, and one of them will come away with uh, their second win. Okay, and that game is on 880KRVN. On 93.1 The River, I've got an old-fashioned rivalry. This is a team, This is a game that has been played for 105 years. Gothenburg and Kozad in Kozad. A couple teams coming off of losses last week. Gothenburg losing 22-7 to Ogallala, and uh, the Haymakers losing 41-6 to Carney Catholic should be a good game, though. It's one of those games where you can kind of throw out the records, Tyler, and you just both of these teams get after each other. They see each other a lot in all the sports, and so it's a good Southwest Conference rivalry. I expect this one to, to go a while. Both offenses have struggled as of late a little bit. Whichever one can get on track, make the fewest mistakes, probably comes out a winner. That one on 93.1, the river. So this week, a triple header of action once again on the sister stations. It will be Gothenburg Kozad, myself and Gene Curtis of the call on the river. Over on 880KRVN, Tyler Cavalli and Evan Jones will have the call of Superior and Southern Valley. And on Cami, Sydney and Lexington will battle Jason Jorgensen and Darren Hansen with the call on that. For the High School Football Preview Show, I'm Scott Foster. This is Tyler Cavalli. Have a great week.